or, or any other mode of transport. You need your van? I need my van, yeah. Same as everybody else. I just want to say, my name's Phil, I'm from LBC. And Boris Johnson says that 80% of traffic coming into London doesn't need to be, doesn't need to happen. It's all discretionary. People are choosing to drive their cars. Are you choosing to drive your van this morning? No. What do you do for a living? I'm a travelling fitter, working for a company in London. And it's part of my job to drive through London to sites. Could you just talk to tools and bits and bobs on the back of your back of the bike? That's cool. No. Right? Sure, I wouldn't care. No way. Large <laughs> spanners, large hammers. Well, what, what, about, what about taking public transport? Put it all on the nice one bus. Can you imagine one of these young office ladies in a nice new suit and skirt, ready to go, and a big greasy fit to get some with a bag of spanners? I can't see that, can you? I'm wondering, could you choose to take the underground into London? I'm a living. I'm actually working right now. Uh, what, what, what do you do for a living, sir? Work in the film industry. The film industry? Could you put your cameras on the back of a bicycle? Uh, I don't think you could. They're quite heavy. No, I don't, I don't choose to take the journey, but I've had a job this way, and I'm trying to get back into town. So you didn't? You could, you didn't want to sort of take somebody on the back of a tandem bicycle in your cab? No, no, I didn't, no. How do you think it would work out? You could get, you know, clear run on the cycle superhighway? Yeah, I know. If I was fit enough and young enough, yeah, maybe. They seem to think we all want to ride bikes, but we don't. All right, right. Interesting. interesting selection of views there, Theo. Uh, I'm going to tell us first of all, when is this all going to come to fruition? When can people use the cycle superhighway? When are you and Andrew Gilligan going to cycle down uh, together, hopefully, in Harbour? Uh, OK, well, the cycle superhighway on Lower Thames Street is due to be completed in time uh, for this uh, year's London Marathon in April. So that should be open then. In terms of the Westway project, it will actually be up to the new mayor, the, for, whoever succeeds Boris Johnson, to decide whether to proceed with this project. It is expensive. It's in excess of £40 million pounds for all three cycle schemes. And it will be up to either Steve Khan or uh, Zach Goldsmith to decide whether to press ahead with that. If they do decide to press ahead with those schemes, uh, work will start in around 2018. All right, so looking forward to bringing you more for the cycle super highway. Make sure, make sure you wait on high biz when you're out and about, especially under a gallon anywhere uh, nearby. 8.38, Theo. Whatever you're looking for, call 118434. Calls cost £3.99 plus £1.39 per minute in addition to your network's access charge. Day 3, our holiday aboard Britannia continues to enchant. By day, we explore like Marco Polo. By night, we dine a la Marco Pierre White. Most afternoons, we soak in the spas, sip oil grays at high tea, and pop a few pastries down the hatch. Day 10, the sunrise above Barcelona is so magical, I almost dropped my breakfast sausage. Cruises on Britannia start from 899 per person for seven nights for the balcony cabin. Book at POCruises.com or your travel agent before the 19th of February and receive £340.